everyone. This is my friend Antonio. He is from New Jersey and he is here getting hedgehog number three and four. He is adopting retirees Nancy and Nina. And um, we were just having a conversation about your first two hedgehogs, um, Athena and Ziggy. Can you tell me about their personality? Because I think that will be eye opening for some people. Uh, definitely, they're, uh, they're very, very different uh, individual personalities. Uh, one uh, can be very, they're both very explore, uh, they love to explore. Um, with Ziggy, though, uh, she has been very uh, anxious whenever I would hold her with my hands. So, and every time she would do that, uh, she just kind of like, you know, would run away or stuff or fall up a lot. But other than that, she would explore on my lap, explore on the couch or bed and stuff like that. Uh, even within the snuggle, uh, the bonding bag or uh, um, the sleeping bag, uh, she's completely calm in it. It's just, she's not, she doesn't like being held with, uh, with my hands. With Athena, completely opposite. She's completely cool with me holding her uh, with, with my hands and uh, with the bonding bag and sleeping bag. It's immediately when she goes into it, she would just love to like dig like she's burrowing and stuff. Where Ziggy is, you know, she doesn't do that. She goes in and she just sleeps and stuff. And but with Athena, she just, you know, loves to dig and stuff. And that just kind of shows that, you know, even though they're both hedgehogs, they're completely different, mm -hmm. have completely different personalities like people. Mm -hmm. and stuff like that so so one and, and you said they're different sizes even though you oh, got them definitely. at the same time so, same time uh athena is around 600 grams uh maybe 610 mm -hmm. and ziggy is uh 420 the last time i checked was a couple days ago and they're completely healthy they eat drink and exercise on their wheel like normal mm -hmm. hedgehogs should and without yeah the uh, besides that, they're completely normal when doing normal hedgehog things. So they're happy, they're healthy. Happy, happy and healthy. They just have different activities during their happiness. Yeah, one uh, I guess likes to eat a little more than the other, and that's completely fine. Mm -hmm. So that and so so you're still able to hold and enjoy them both just differently. Of course, just completely differently. Yes. Do they have different taste preferences, differences in treats, or anything like that? Um, yes, actually, I. Uh, uh athena uh who is the bigger one she likes vegetables um they both like vegetables but athena eats more vegetables than ziggy ziggy mm -hmm. likes to eat a little more fruits okay than, uh athena so if i put the same amount of fruits and vegetables in front of them mm -hmm. uh athena will eat more vegetables while ziggy will eat more uh, okay what are their fruits. favorites um athena's cucumber and uh ziggy is apple okay yeah that's neat do they eat like cooked chicken or any... i've done i haven't done cooked chicken yet uh because i think every time i would think about it i the chicken that i would have would just be seasoned already so at that point mm -hmm. i can't really give it to them but um that's next on the list okay to try uh just unseasoned cooked chicken and see how they uh, respond to that uh they're not too big on uh scrambled eggs Okay, that was going to be my next question. Yeah, they're not too big on that. Uh, they do eat it, but not as much as I thought, I guess. Mm -hmm. So, I guess they'll eat it if it's the last resort, but other than that... Uh, do they have any go-to treats that they really like? Uh, the one bag that I got from you. Okay. Uh, I get, I just use that once, okay. once in a while. I'll just give them that, and they'll, and they'll eat it right up. So, I think there's... Oh, that and... Uh, I think it was like the banana the and banana chicken, chicken wrap yes they absolutely tore through that initially yeah good good yeah. that's one of our favorites that we've yes. noticed too yes well thank you for sharing oh, like you're very welcome there i think it's helpful for people to know just the the differences in personalities just like oh, kids yes. and it's it's like it's like it's like people uh you're going to get different mm -hmm. different personalities when you uh get hedgehogs they're never going to be the same they're always uh they're always gonna you know keep you on your toes at least Good, yeah. good. Do they, one last question. Sure. Do they act differently with different people than they do with you? That's a good question. Uh, yes. Yes, they do. Um, though they haven't really met other people too mm -hmm. much. Like, they met my brother and his girlfriend. And, uh, but if they're just standing there, mm -hmm. just admiring and just uh, looking at them, they wouldn't mind all that mm -hmm. much. 
Uh, so uh, the presence of someone new doesn't startle them. Mm -hmm. uh, I haven't had them pick them up yet or something like that. Uh, mm -hmm. But yeah, they uh, they would. I, I assume they would act different if they would like hold them and things. hold them and stuff. Uh, you know, just how they kind of got used to me and stuff. Mm -hmm. They're just bonded to you. Exactly. Yeah. Okay. Well, thank you. You're very welcome.